Assalamualaikum and hi, my name is Nick Nurjanati Adinin binti Nordin, student ID 2020476992 and my supervisor is Madam Rojana binti Bujang and co-supervisor is Madam Nor Habibah binti Rosli. Welcome to my presentation to my, to my panels and to all viewers. So today, I'm going to present on my paper with the title Repellence Effect of Tapioca Leaf Manuha Esculenta Extract Towards American Cockroach Periplanata Americana. So let's start with the first chapter, Introductions. Cockroaches are commonly found in every household and possibly transmit disease to humans, leaving an unappealing smell to surrounding and destroy the household goods. Problem Statement The use of synthetic insecticides on cockroach has directed on non-target organism dangers, environmental, environmental disruptions, and cockroach pesticide resistance. The objective of the study is to investigate the repellent activity of Manifa Escalenta towards Periplanata Americana to determine the most effective concentrations of extract from Manifa Escalenta in repelling the Periplanata Americana and to screen the chemical compositions of extract from Manifa Escalenta using FTIR. Next, Chapter 2, which is Literature Review. Biopesticides are certain type of pesticide that use their natural enemies as a control. Regita 2014 has reported some plant has the ability in killing and keeping the pest away. Periplanata americana is the second most common insect pest found in commercial and large building and almost in all households. Rapid populations uh, growth of cockroach in short time periods in short time generations make it challenging and co in controlling their populations. Chemical compositions of Manihot Escolenta consist of cyanogenic gly glycoside, which is linamarine, lotosralin, and amyctalin. This presents play an essential role in uh, pest management. Insect repellents is a substance that uh, deter insects from approaching the surface. Insect repellents are known as pesticides, which intend to prevent, destroy, and mitigate uh, any pest. Chapter 3 Methodology this is the flow uh, process of the lab works. First, manure esculenta was obtained from the white market at Panda Pusat Jenke. Second, Periplanata americana was collected using DIY trap. Adult cockroach were obtained and sustained in a container with a few holes. The species was uh, the species of the cockroach was were authorized by Puan Rosiana binti Bujang. Third, uh, the preparations of leaf extract using maceration technique. 60 gram powdered leaf were extracted with 600 milliliter methanol for 5 days as suggested by TOSIF 2022. The extract were filtered and were concentrated under reduced pressure at 45 degrees Celsius using rotary evaporator to obtain a dark brown crude extract. The crude extract was dried at room temperature and uh, then was added to distilled water to create a different concentrations of 25%, 50%, 75%, and 100%. Distilled water was used as negative control. The extract was kept in a spray bottle shown in figure 3.3. Next is FTIR analysis. The spectrum 100 Fourier transform infrared spectrometer was conducted to de determine the functional group of plant extract. Then, the repellent test was carried out by using choice pop displayed in figure 3.1. The choice pop consists of two chambers labeled with A, treated zone, and B, untreated zone. Four spray of extract was placed in treated zone. Five cockroach were exposed to the setup through the middle opening chamber. Cockroach uh, positioned in treated and untreated zone were carefully observed and count for every 10, 20, and 30 minutes of the treatment. The test was conducted in duplicate. The data generated from this study was analyzed using one-way ANOVA as suggested by NOR 2017 to determine the significant difference of uh, percentage of repellent activity between concentrations. The statistical analysis was performed using SPSS version 29. Chapter 4, Result and Discussions The percentage yield of uh, extract acquired is 83.7% 83 uh, This yield uh, it obtained is expected to be less than 100% because there is reactions and loss of samples during macerations. FTIR analysis was conducted to compare the functional group that present in the Manihot Escolenta leaf extract. The first peak, 3,374 cm, indicating the presence of O-bond H stretching, such as hydroxyl and carboxyl group, usually in cellulose. 
Oborn H bending at 1,359cm may reflect off panel. 1,061cm peaks are associated with C bone H stretching of primary alcohol. Primary alcohol is classified by the presence of carbon atom of hydroxyl group is connected to single acyl group. This type of alcohol include uh, methanol with each which is associated with maceration that, is, that use alcohol as the solvent. The finding compound might give rise to the amount of the antioxidant detoxifying and insect immune enzyme as stated by Manjula 2019. Repellent activity of many hot esculenta extract against Periplanata americana. Negative eye value from the table show the many hot esculenta extract has the ability to repel the cockroach. 75% give the highest re the highest percentage of repellency against Periplanata americana with 100% repellency in all 3 time interval. 100% concentrations of treatment did not show 100% repellency because there was random error during transferring the cockroach in the middle opening chamber. I and PC has inverse relationship where the lowest uh, the negative value of I, the highest the percentage of repellent activity. In the present study by Tambi and Cherry in 2015, proved that extractions of many hot esculenta using al alcohol have the have a potential in producing pesticidal activity. It is correlated in the current experiment where Periplanata americana avoided contact with the place exposed to the many hot esculenta extract. Sarita Verma 2013 stated that the toxic substance known as cyanogenic glucoside contained in tapioca leaf have succeeded in biopesticide. Figure 4.2 display the trend of eye value is declining as the concentrations of many hot esculenta extract is increasing in 10, 20, and 30 minutes. Figure 4.3 shows the percentage of repellent activity is expanding as the concentrations of many hot esculenta extract is rising. All concentrations of extract show repellent activity against Periplanata americana with the highest 75% concentration, followed by 100%, 50%, and 25%. Next, statistical analysis. There was a statistically significant difference between each concentration as determined by one-way ANOVA with the p-value less than 0.001. So to summarize, the present study strongly suggested that the requirement in further investigations of plant-based product in pest control management. The evidence from this study that many hot esculenta leaf extract can be used as pesticide by repelling Periplanata americana. For further research, determining the effectiveness of using different extraction solvent instead of different concentrations can be the new area of research and innovations. Thank you for listening.